Good morning. We are here with Wellness Yoga, and today we're going to um, use a chair so and a strap. So grab yourself a chair, preferably something that doesn't have arms on it, So because we kind of turn and move and do a few things. Arms get in the way. Also, we'll use a strap, a yoga strap or um, whatever you've got at home. If you don't have this, you can use like a towel. You can use an old necktie or a belt, something like that. You might need a block if, you, if you've if you taken this class before and you use a block. We, I don't have mine today, but um, you, you might do that. I'll let you know when, when is a good time for that. So we'll go ahead and start in, sit up nice and tall, lengthening in the spine. And we'll start by squeezing our shoulders up to our ears and then squeeze and press your shoulder blades together. Push your elbows and your shoulders down. Roll and round, squeeze the shoulders up, squeeze and press together. Push, press down. Roll and round up. Squeeze and press together. Push the elbows and the shoulders down. One more. Roll and round. Squeeze the shoulders up to the ears. Squeeze and press together. Push, press down, and then relax the shoulders. Start to tuck your chin to your chest. Lift your head up and back. Chin to chest. Lift up and back. Chin to chest. Lift your head back to the center and turn your head to the right. Look over the right shoulder. Center. Look to the left. Center. Right. Center. Left. Center. Now let's drop our ear to the shoulder on the right. Just let the neck stretch out, breathing. Remember to breathe when we stretch. Let your left arm hang down at your side. See if you can reach those fingertips a little closer to the ground. Slowly, gently bring your head back up to center. Bring your hand back. So take a breath here. Inhale. And exhale. Begin to tilt your head to the left side. Ear to shoulder on the left. Keep with your breath. Let your right arm hang down at your side. See if you can push that shoulder down a little, reaching the fingertips a little closer to the ground. Slowly bring your head back up, bring your hand back to the center. Ear to shoulder on the right side. Start to shift your head slightly front to back, keeping your ear toward the shoulder. Pausing if you need to stretch a little longer anywhere. Nice and easy, start to lift your head back up to center. Begin to tilt left, 
ear to shoulder, front to back. Small movements. Bring your head back up to center. Roll the shoulders back. Hold it here and interlace your fingers behind your head. Gently tuck your chin towards your chest, drawing the elbows together. Sit up, bring the head back up, let the arms come down, relax your shoulders, and as you sit up nice and tall, we're going to take two fingers to our chin. Using your fingers as a guide, we're going to shift our head straight back, slightly tucking the chin. Gently release. You should feel that in the neck and shoulders. Two fingers to the chin. Shift your head straight back, slightly tucking the chin. We've switched hands. Gently release. Let's bring our right leg up and flex the foot. Bring it down and left leg up, flex the foot. Bring it down. Right leg up, circle the foot. Change direction. Bring it down and left leg circle. Change direction. Bring it down. Now let's take our right leg up Flexing the foot, left arm reaches up and switch. Left leg, right arm reaches up, switch. Right leg, left arm, left leg, right arm. Right leg, left arm, left leg, right arm. Right leg, left arm, left leg, right arm. Switch, right leg, left arm, left leg, right arm. Now. We're gonna do it a little bit different, so we're gonna change it up. Right leg comes up, left arm out to the side, fingers open, press the arm back and switch. Left leg comes up, right arm reaches out, press the hand back, switch. Right leg, left arm, release. Left leg, right arm, switch. Right leg, left arm, Switch, left leg, right arm. Switch, right leg, left arm, press it back. Last one, left leg, right arm, press back. Good, release here. So sit up nice and tall. We're gonna take our right hand behind the head. Just the fingertips can rest behind the head. Begin to tilt left, lifting your elbow to the sky and shifting your gaze up. And come on up. Let's switch. Left hand behind the head. Tilt to the right. Elbow to the sky. Come on up. We switch back. 
right hand, tilt left. Come on up, again. Left hand, tilt right. Come on up. Now, let's take our right hand to the upper part of the back. So your palm is resting at the upper neck, shoulder area. Use your left hand to grab hold of that right elbow. Start to lift higher. Check in with your head. You're not pushing your head too far forward. You're sitting up nice and tall, lengthen. Deep breath in. As you exhale, tilt left. Give the elbow a little pull. Come on up to center. Release, relax your shoulders. Give them a little break and we'll switch. Left hand to the upper back. Right hand holds the elbow. Lift higher and check in with your head. Breathe here. Inhale. Exhale, tilt to the right. Pull. Center. Gently release. Wiggle it out, soften through the shoulders, give them a little break. Now, we're going to turn to the right side in our chair, so you want your legs bent over that right side. Sit up nice and tall, and we walk the hands back on the chair. So, twisting here, look over the right shoulder. Gently untwist, we'll make our way back to the center. Hold it here in the middle, reach the arms up, inhale. Exhale, fold right through the center, let your head come down. Relax through the shoulders, the head. Now round the spine, come on up, coming to center. Turn left in your chair. Left leg, or left, your legs are bent over that left side. Sit tall and give a twist to the left. Walk the hands back on the chair. Gently untwist. Make your way back to the center. Hold it here. Feet about hip width distance. Inhale, sweep the arms all the way up. Exhale, we fold through the center. Relax your head, relax your neck. Nice and easy, round the spine coming up. We're going to cross our right leg all the way over our left leg. If this is hard for you or it doesn't quite work for you, you can always do it without crossing the legs. Inhale, sweep the arms all the way up. As you exhale, bring your arms halfway down in front. We're going to cross our left arm over the right arm. So you want to cross at the elbows or above the elbows if you can. Bend the elbows. So now the backs of my hands are touching. You can stay here with your elbows bent. You're forming a lock. To add more, you're gonna wrap the hands. So your right fingers are touching the left palm here. If this doesn't work for you, you're gonna cross here and then just take your hands to your shoulders like this. So this is the modification. If you don't quite form that lock there, just do this, kind of give yourself a hug like this. So. Whichever spot works for you, exhale, let your elbows tuck toward the chest. As you inhale, lift your elbows above the heart. And then hold it here, opening through those shoulder blades, breathing. Start to tuck your elbows to your chest. Tuck your chin to your chest and round the spine. 
rounding the upper back. Inhale, lifting to the center. Sweep the arms all the way up, reach. And as you exhale, bring those arms back down at your side. Good. Sit tall and give a twist to the right. Look over the right shoulder. Untwist, back to center, uncross the legs. So we're gonna switch sides. Left leg crosses over the right leg. Inhale, lift the arms up. Exhale, bring them halfway down in front. Now you're gonna cross your right arm over your left arm. Remember, you can modify by just placing the hands on the shoulders. You can do more by wrapping the hands. The left fingers are at the right palm. Exhale, wherever you're at, tuck your elbows to your chest. Inhale, lift your elbows above the heart. Tuck your elbows to your chest, tuck your chin to your chest, and round the upper back. Lift to center. Sweep those arms all the way up, inhale. And as you exhale, palms down arms down at your side relax your shoulders sit tall lengthen and twist left exhale gently untwist coming to center uncross the legs so we're going to heel toe walk the feet out and in moving at your own pace heel toe We're gonna have wide legs, so heel toe your feet open, wide legs here. Inhale, sweep the arms all the way up. Exhale, fold through the center and reach your hands forward. So if your hands don't reach and you have a block at home, you can reach forward for a block. Wherever you're at, let your head come down. Lengthen. And then nice and easy, press your way back up, rounding to come up to center. Inhale, arms all the way up, palms and elbows together out in front. Open, press the elbows and the arms back, close, exhale. Inhale, open, press back, exhale, close. Inhale, open, exhale, close. Inhale, open, exhale, close. Inhale, open, stay here. Arms pressing back. Draw the elbows in at your side. Keep pressing those hands back, fingers open, sitting tall. You'll feel that in the shoulders, kind of under the arm. Inhale all the way up. Exhale, fold through the center. Let your head come down. Round the spine, come on up slow. If you're using a block, you'll place it right down in the center here where you can reach it. We're gonna move a little bit faster and we're gonna fold through the center, just tapping the fingers down and coming up quick. So tap the fingers down and come on up. Reach down and up. Reach down and up. Down, up. 
down, up, down, up. One more, down, up, good. Bring those feet back in. We're gonna sit back in our chair. If you've moved around at all, sit back. We're gonna take our right leg up, flex the foot, and point the toes. Flex, and point, flex, and point. Flex, point, flex, point. Flex and lower the leg down. Left leg comes up, flex the foot. Point the toes. Flex. Point. Flex. Point. Flex. Point. Flex. Point. Flex and lower that leg. Right leg up, flex the foot. Reach your left arm all the way up. Reach down. So wherever that is for you, wherever you reach to, it might be near the knee, near the shin, near the toes, anywhere you can reach. Inhale all the way up. Exhale, reach down. Inhale, up. Exhale, down. Inhale, up and release. Left leg comes up, flex the foot, right arm reaches up. Reach down, inhale, up, exhale down. Inhale, up, exhale down, all the way up and release. Now we're gonna take our hands to our hips. So sitting up nice and tall, we're gonna bring our feet up, both feet up, and open up a little bit so there's space between the feet. Turn the toes into the center. You might feel those bones moving inside, those upper legs. Turn the toes out and in. Turn out and in. Out and in. Turn out and in. Out and in. Out and in. Out, in, out, in, last one, out, and release. Give the feet a little wiggle, shake it out. Now, move forward in your chair, coming toward the edge of your seat. Reach back for the chair. So it might be down on the corners or if you have bars or something on the chair that you can grab hold of. Reach back and grab hold. We're gonna lean our chest forward so we have space. Now move your head straight back, slightly tucking the chin. Your arms should be extended. Nice and easy. Release, soften through the shoulders, give them a little break. Now, staying at the edge of your seat, we're gonna take our right leg out in front, heel down, toes up, and step it back in. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. right left, right, left. One more, right, left, and hold it here. Extend your right leg, heel down, toes up. Check that your left knee and heel are lined up. So you want that left foot all the way on the floor. If you're using a block, you're gonna take it somewhere to the outside of this right leg. So it might be back here, above the knee, it might be further down, closer to the foot. And if you have a block, you can always have it tall or turn it on its side, reaching down a little further. Blocks just give you a little space, a little extra space to breathe, space to reach to. Inhale, lift the arms all the way up. Exhale, fold, reach down.
take it out. Give that leg a little break. Switch it, left leg, heel down, toes up. Inhale, lift the arms, exhale, reach down. Give that leg a little break, shake it out. Now go right leg out to the side. Your heel is down, your toes are up. If you have a block, place it right down in the center. Inhale, lift the arms, exhale, fold through the middle. Now from here, you can add a little more. If it's not enough, you can shift your leg further back. If it's too much, draw the leg in. So bring it back in a little, bend the knee a little. You should feel that on the inner thigh. Nice and easy. Come on up, shake out that leg, give it a break. Keep your block there if you're using it. Left leg out to the side, heel is down, toes are up. Inhale, sweep those arms up. Exhale, fold through the middle. Breathe. Lengthen, 
hinge forward, exhale. So we want to be bending right here just at the hips. Check in, your shoulders are open and down. Chin up, hold it here. Also, check your other foot. This chair is a little bit tall, so my heel is a little bit raised up, but you want to try and make sure your foot is all the way down with soft toes. We're just working the right side. Inhale, come up and exhale, bring the leg down, switch. Left leg up, sit tall, lengthen, elbows are in, shoulders are down, hinge forward, exhale, keep the chin up and open through the shoulders. We're trying not to round the back. As soon as you round your spine here, rounding in the upper shoulders, you're gonna stop feeling that where you should be feeling that. We are stretching the back of the leg, the hamstring here, bending at the hips. Come on up and release. Right leg is gonna come up and out to the right side. So lift your right leg, extend the right arm, hold your strap pieces in the right hand and open. Check the other foot, your heel is down, your toes are soft. Left arm reaching out, look over the left shoulder. Center, place it down, switch. Left leg up and out to the left side. Check your other foot, right arm out, look over the right shoulder. Center, place it down. We're gonna go back to that right leg. So we're gonna bring our right leg up so that our heel and our hip are about lined up again. This time, start by stretching your left arm out in front of you and then bring your hand down and hold the strap pieces. So right leg, left arm. Sit up nice and tall, lengthen. Exhale, right arm reaches back, look over the right shoulder. Center, bring it down. Left leg up. Right arm extends. Lengthen, sit tall. Reach back, exhale. Center, place it down. Right leg. We're gonna lift that right leg up and hold it here. So check in again that your shoulders are down, your elbows are down. See if you can flex that foot a little bit. Deep breath in. As you exhale, maybe lifting that leg just a touch higher. Place it down. Left leg. We're gonna bring it up and hold it here. Deep inhale. Exhale higher. Gently release. Right leg. Lift your right leg up. Extend your left arm. Hold your strap pieces in the left hand. Cross your right leg to the left side. Right arm out, look over the right shoulder. Center, bring it down. Left leg, bring it up. Right arm extends. Grab those strap pieces in the right hand. Cross your left leg over 
to the right side. Left arm out, look over the left shoulder. And remember, when you're stretching, when you're here, re relax that other foot, check in. Your right heel is down, your toes are soft. Center, bring it down. Take your strap, let it rest on top of the legs and wiggle out your hands, let your hands shake out, let the fingers relax. And then open and close your hands, open and close. Now, let your left hand come down and close your right hand into a fist. Figure eight on that right hand. Kind of check in. Is your arm moving a bunch? We're working just the wrist here. So, trying to keep that elbow from moving too much. It's going to move a little bit. Change direction. So, figure eight the other way. That's your brain exercise for today. We might do one more. <laughs> Wiggle it out. Shake out that hand and switch. Left hand, close your hand into a fist. Figure eight. Change direction. that out. Right hand out in front. Use your left hand to press back on each finger, stretching the fingers. Work your way all the way through and then go back again so all the fingers are getting two stretches and then switch hands whenever you're ready. Wiggle them out. Shake those fingers out and close your hands into fists. Circle the hands. Change direction. Good. Wiggle it out. Now, extend both arms. Have your fingertips pointing up and your palms forward. We're gonna tilt our right hand and turn it right and turn it back up. Left hand, turn it out and back up. Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Again, right, left, right, left. Now, make a little space. We're gonna keep it here and turn in. So right hand turns in and up. Left hand in and up. Right, left, right, left. Right, left, right, left. Right, left, right, left. One more. Good, shake it out. Give your arms and your hands a little break. Soften through the shoulders. Now, sit with both feet on the ground and make a little space. So maybe your feet are a little, just a little bit wider than the hips. Um, we want space between the knees. Take your strap, fold it one more time. So I've got it folded in half and then I'm gonna fold it once more. So you want it neatly lined up. Arms extended, hold on right in the center of the strap so your hands are touching. Inhale, lift all the way up with control. Exhale, push forward, press down. Inhale, up. Exhale, press down and forward. Come halfway up. Inhale, halfway up. Pull right. Center, pull left. Center, right, center, 
left, center, push forward and down. And then relax those shoulders, give them a little break. Then we're gonna come all the way up. So arms extended, inhale all the way up. Tilt right, pull. Center, left. Center, right. Center, left. Center and push forward. Press down. Relax the shoulders. Give your shoulders a little break. Now, we're gonna come up again, but we want wide arms. So I'm gonna open my strap one time. You might open it all the way, depending on how long your strap is. Um, and depending on how long your arms are. So we wanna be able to push the arms back. I'm gonna show you first really quick. So if you are holding your strap and you're stuck like this with your elbows bent, you need more space. You wanna be able to open the arms and press them all the way back like this with your strap. So if you get stuck, give yourself more space. If you have to bend your elbows a bunch, give yourself more space. Inhale, we lift up. Exhale, press back. Inhale, up. Exhale, down. Inhale, lift. Exhale, back. Inhale, up. Exhale, down. One more time, all the way up. And exhale, back. Inhale, up, and then bring it down. Relax your arms, relax your shoulders. Give them a little break. Now I'm gonna take my strap behind my back. So move forward to the edge of your seat. Take your strap behind you. You can have wide arms or keep your hands nice and close. I folded my strap one more time. So with wide legs, heel toe open, fold through the middle, lift the arms and let your head come down. Nice and easy, let's come on up and release the strap. So move your strap out of the way, step your feet back in. We're gonna sit down in our chair where our feet can touch the ground. You, you wanna be grounded here. Your feet are about hip width distance apart. Um, if you need to, you can use your hands to help yourself get up. We're gonna stand up and sit down a few times in a couple of different ways. So just remember, do what works for you. If you are stuck sitting down, then just stay seated, that's okay. So um, we're gonna start by crossing our hands over our shoulders and then stand up. And have a seat. Now switch your hands and stand up. And have a seat. Now, we're going to take our arms out in front here. This will be the last time we stand up, but we're gonna also do one more from standing. So arms out, stand up. Step your feet in. So I wanna have your big toes kind of touching and then a little space between the heels. A natural stance of just bringing those feet closer together. We're gonna bend our knees and send the hips back coming halfway down. Your knees are gonna draw together. Draw the belly in, engaging the core. Hold five, four, three, two, one, straighten out. Relax your arms, your shoulders. Um, if you have a mat that you're using, we're gonna take our chair forward to the front of the mat. So you want all four legs of the chair on the mat so that you have space to move around behind the chair without without sliding around or any movement in the chair okay we'll start with the lunge we're going to step our right leg back so when we lunge 
you want to be really close to the chair. If you're too far away, you're going to be reaching for the chair and you won't have good posture. So let's step our right leg back. Our front knee and heel are lined up. Remaining upright here, holding on to the chair. Take a breath in. Exhale. This time our right arm comes up. Inhale, right arm up. Exhale, we're gonna drop our back heel down. Reach that right arm behind us. Turn your head forward looking over the chair with your breath. Inhale, exhale, tilt toward the chair, reach and sweep that right arm overhead. Inhale, reach back. Exhale, reach over. Inhale. Up and back, gazes forward, exhale, reach over, inhale, bring it back. Now let's sweep that hand back to the chair. Lift your back heel to step in. We're nice and close to the chair again. Left leg is going to step back. Your front knee and heel are lined up with your breath. Hold it here, inhale, exhale. Inhale, left arm comes up. Exhale, drop that back heel. Reach the left arm back, your gaze is forward. Inhale. Exhale, reach over and tilt. Inhale, up and back. Exhale, tilt and reach. Inhale, up and back. Exhale, tilt and reach. Come on back, sweep that hand back, lift the back heel and step back in. Wiggle out those legs. Turn to the right side. So turning right, you're gonna take a side step. You wanna move away from the chair a little bit so you're not going to run into the chair when you try and balance. You want space on either side for you to kind of move your arms and your hands and catch yourself. So our left hand is touching the chair. Start by propping your right heel up near the left ankle. The toes are down. So remember to take this slow. Balance isn't going to come fast and easy. So just do it step by step with concentration and you might find you're a little more balanced. So our knee is opening up to the side. We're gonna slowly bring one finger away from the chair at a time. Now, if you're wobbly here and you still have a finger on the chair, just keep it there. You're gonna find you can hold it steadier. So if your hands free up, you might take your hands to your heart. So I still have my toes down. See how your balance is here. If it's great, then bring your foot further up the leg. Hold it here. Wiggle it out. Shake out those legs. Turn around to the other side. So remember too, you wanna to keep a gazing point. So some spot to keep your eye on, to keep focused. It might be like a light switch or some little thing in the room that you can focus on. Maybe a spot on the wall. So our right hand is touching the chair. Prop your left heel up near the right ankle. Our left knee is opening to the side. This is a hip opener with balance. So move your fingers away from the chair. Maybe just one finger at a time. See how you feel. You can keep those toes down for support, like a little kickstand. If your hands free up, then maybe feel like you can bring your foot a little further up the leg. Keep your focus. Never look at like a person or something like a dog. They move way too much. So you want to just keep your focus on something that's stuck in one place.
Wiggle it out, shake the legs out. Give your legs a little break, turn back towards your chair. We're going to step our right foot back, drop that back heel down. Back foot's at a 45 degree angle and our front leg will straighten out as well. You want your heels about lined up here. So it's not a super wide gap. We're going to fold over that front leg. So breathe in, lengthen through the spine, hinging at the hips. Breathe out, keep a flat back, hold it here. Come on up. Now we're gonna add a little more. Same thing, but lift the toes off the ground in the front. So just your heel is down and your toes are up. Lengthen and exhale. Hinge and fold. Inhale. Press back up, lower those toes, step back in, and left foot's gonna step back. Heels are about lined up, your back foot's at a 45 degree angle. Lengthen, hinge, exhale. You'll feel that in those hamstrings. Breathing, flat back. Press back up. Now we switch it up. Lift the toes, just the heel is down. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale. Fold and hinge. Press up, lower those toes, step in. Now we're gonna stretch our calves. So we're gonna step our right foot back, maybe a little wider this time. Our front knee is bent, but we want both toes down on the ground, both heels down on the ground. So hold it here. You're pressing into that chair so that you have a little resistance here. You'll start to feel that in the right calf. See if you can lift and engage the right kneecap. Breathe into that. And then soften. Step back in. Left foot back. Both heels and toes are down. A soft bend in the front right knee. Stretching the left calf. Engage the left kneecap. Flexing the foot. 
breathing and opening through those hips. on up, shake it out, wiggle out your leg, left foot on top of the right leg, lengthen, sit tall, hinge forward, exhale, breathe into that hip, shake out that left leg, give it a little break, and then open the feet, wide legs here. Inhale, sweep the arms all the way up. Bend your elbows, grab hold of the elbows with the hands. Fold right through the center. Relax your head, relax your shoulders. Let the weight of the arms pull you down a little further. Release your hands down to the ground. Walk your fingertips forward, lengthen through the spine. Nice and easy, press back up, walk those hands back in. Sit back in your chair. We're gonna close our eyes and make ourselves comfortable in our chair. So sit back, relax into the chair. Just start to relax your toes, your feet, and your ankles. Relax your calves, your knees, and your thighs. Relax your glutes, your hips, and your low back. Soften through the middle back and the abdominal muscles as you exhale. Exhale, any tension in the belly. Relax your upper back, your chest, your shoulders, and your shoulder blade. Soften the upper arms, the elbows, the forearms, and the wrists. Relax your palms, your fingers, and your fingertips. Soften through the neck and the spine. Relaxing all the way down the back to the tailbone. Relax your scalp, your ears your forehead and your eyelids. Soften the cheeks and the nose. Relax your lips. Let the lips separate and loosen the jaw. No tension in the jaw. Relax your chin, your tongue and your throat, releasing the tongue from the upper part of the mouth. Flowing and quieting your breath, clearing your mind, and allowing the whole body to completely relax. 